Hi everyone, this is 3D ultrasound tutorial. My to this case is a benign mesenchymal mass at the supraclavicular region, most likely hemangioma. On high frequency 2D ultrasound, it appeared as a complex mass with internal predominantly solid components. Mass was confined within the muscle layer and has no communication beyond it. Color Doppler shows internal vascularity. The feeding artery is most likely originated from the branches of right subclavian artery with a peak systolic velocity of 25 cm per second. This is a 3D view of the lesion. Now a short tutorial about this 3D image processing. The volume acquisition done by pressing the 3D button over the lesion. I'm targeting the upper and left picture. I'm taking the plus point to the lesion by the cursor. You can see that other axes are getting changed. Now I'm selecting the second image and taking the dot line over the lesion. This is the Y axis one and you can see the difference on the 3D image. Now I'm choosing the fourth image that is the 3D image and opening it on a single screen from the touch panel. Okay, now I need some editing. I will use smoothing, transparency, threshold and slice options to make the image beautiful. Now I'm changing the smoothing. I'm changing it from smooth to a detailed one. Now I'm changing threshold. I'm decreasing and increasing that to have a better view. I'm rotating the image for a better view. Trying to see whether the threshold level is OK or not. Now I'm zooming the image to fit the screen. Excess zoom in may cut your image borders, so be a little careful about that. Now I will cut the image by pressing the Sculpt option. I will just keep the structure I want to see on the display. We'll remove rest. Okay, that looks like a sandwich. Now zoom a little bit. Oops, again lost a few border while rotating. Bright areas are the solid components. Some inside cavities are seen which were darker in 2D images also. Now I will change the view pattern. It's always fun. Let's do it. This is surface 1, not good. Surface 2, more darker. Dine color, it adds some colors on the darker image. Skeletal, that's not bad though. Invert, ooh, horrible. True view, that's my one. Lastly, glass view, not so great in this case. So that's all. I'm showing this tutorial on Philips Affinity 50. Try to do it on your machine. The main technique is quite same in every machine with HD 3D. I hope this basic will help you. 
I will try to post more videos on solid organ 3D tutorials. So, if you are new on my channel, consider subscribing. Don't forget to give your valuable opinions below. Have a nice day.